Scatterbreaker here. I, uh, oh, can I, uh, pause it for a second? Yeah, I'm sorry. I, uh, I just saw Demon Slayer and then, uh, by our, uh, Coogan train, Mugen train. I can't remember now the title exactly, but I'll, I'll get it right in a second. Uh, but anyway, I just wanted to uh, say, if for no other reason to go see something on a big screen, you should go and listen to a Dead Ghost soundtrack while watching it. And uh, a lot of the things that were uh, um, that were, uh, or a lot of the the, uh, the songs really worked with it. And I'm gonna be going back through actually. Um, like I think I was out after. Uh, yeah, that was crazy. You Love Witch on the L.A. Witch album uh, was after I left the movie, but uh, and then Rhythm Rockers, Moondog, I'm gonna be skipping, oh, I apparently can't skip. This is the Rhythm Rockers, Moondog is the name of the album, but I don't know why I can't skip all the way back to so I can't really talk about like what uh, what songs I was listening to. That was like, going to be the whole point of this. Uh, but I know that there was definitely a VOC song on the uh, soundtrack when I uh, when I went on uh, when, it, when it was on the part where the train was like the train was coming at you, coming at you like and it worked perfectly. And then there was some other like uh, man, I wish I well you know I've got some screenshots, so I'll share those. Uh, that, that really works where there was like parts of uh, uh, like 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 uh, like uh, cheesy sort of like you know uh, family time kind of time or moments in the movie and, uh, and the music really works real well with it and, uh, and in other parts you know where you know in these, these sorts of movies it seems like a lot of times the music doesn't match up with the uh, with the uh, uh, like action, so uh, like it's oh, oh, oh yeah. uh, but anyway, it's uh, it doesn't line up with the action, so I just kind of like uh, listen to something on top of that. But I like chaos, so um, so I like you know kind of having chaotic music sound, like so. Um, and I like to listen to things loud, and that's the whole point of going to the movies. Like it's loud enough that, and in this case, actually doesn't matter because the subtitle, so you can just read the what they're saying, you know. Like, but uh, but at the same time, uh, it's like it's like uh, oh, yeah, yeah, man. Oh, so I'm I'm scatterbreaker, and therefore I'm scatterbrained, as you can see. And, uh, oh, you know what? It won't it won't keep like going back to just the uh, witch. Uh, song i'd have to like keep skipping it back and forth to go back to that one but i was i was going back and back and back on the rhythm rockers moon dog and uh it was kind of interesting but <laughs> anyway uh i'm gonna pause it <laughs> uh but yeah so i'm scatterbreaker and so i uh, i'm definitely scatterbreaker and i was talking about the demon slayer movie and i was going to talk about the songs that were in it but i'm gonna have to talk about that later because uh, as it turns out uh I can't even access the songs I was listening to, so I'm gonna have to focus on just like the screenshots I took in the various areas. But maybe I can go back through the list and, and find it. But I'm not sure if I'll be able to do that. So, um, so it's almost like it switched to a whole new station here, and that's what we were just listening to or listening to parts of songs from. I guess I, I should say. Uh, but it was a really good good movie. Uh, good to see on the big screen anyway, but. In order to hear something in addition to the music that's played on the thing, and I don't know how, like, you know, maybe there's people that are loyalists to like the music that comes into the movies or whatever. Right? But with these kind of uh, movies, uh, it's just too poppy for me, I think. So I have to have like some, something heavy and something, uh, uh, something. You know, uh, it's funny. I, I always like the the bad guys parts. Like whenever the music's on, on the bad guys parts, I take off my my headphones. To, to hear the music because it's actually appropriate, I feel like. But when it's on the good guy parts or just the action scenes, it doesn't seem like the music's very appropriate, in my opinion. And therefore, um, I uh, I feel like I just have to listen to something in addition to what they're providing in the movie. So, 
So that's one good reason to go see a movie on the big screen. And I recommend seeing it on the big screen and listening to Dead Ghost Radio. Uh, you don't necessarily need my specific like playlist. In fact, it's kind of interesting to just have like the random sampling of music uh, that would come on that station, on at least on uh, Amazon Music. But I imagine on Pandora or in, or uh, Spotify as well. So anyway, thanks for watching and. Uh, I'll, I'll do a better recommendation and review of this movie later, but this was just kind of my first thoughts along with, you know, the whole, like, personal side of things, so. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. Oh, how are you Oh, I don't know. I have no idea how to, uh, this is actually my second time streaming on Restream, and the first time I haven't even, like, looked and saw what, what it's like. I wonder if there's a big, like, purple area, and then I'm, like, in a tiny little, little rectangle. That'd be funny, but, um, but it might actually be the way that it is. That's the way I kind of see it here. Uh, except the face is a little bit bigger in the screen. So, anyway. Uh, go see Game Slayer and listen to the Go Sound uh, Station on Amazon Music, the, the streaming service, whatever music station. Okay, I'm not uh, being paid by Amazon to say this. <laughs> uh, how do you end this? I have no idea. Oh, in stream, there it is. Okay.